How is the amplification of a gene sample on interest carried out using polymerase chain reaction? So polymerase chain reaction is the amplification of gene of interest that is synthesized with two sets of primers and DNA polymerase enzymes. So if we see here, we require two sets of primers and DNA polymerase enzyme for this PCR reaction. So basically this DNA polymerase enzyme is thermostable which is isolated from a bacterium called Thermus aquaticus called as TAC polymerase. So now we will see the three steps that are involved in the PCR. So usually PCR will consist of three steps denaturation, annealing and extension. So coming to the first step that is denaturation. So here heating the DNA up to 94 degrees centigrade cause the separation of DNA strands. So you can see in the figure the first step upon heating so these two DNA uh, strands will be separated okay. So they heat at the 94 degree centigrade so basically heating the DNA up to 94 degree centigrade it separates the DNA strands. Next Next step is annealing. So in annealing the two sets of primers are added which bind to appropriate complementary segment of DNA strands. So here the two sets of primers that is one is forward primer and another one is reverse primer. So these two sets of primers are added which bind to appropriate complementary segment of DNA strands. So you can see here in the second step and the third step is extension. So polymerization of nucleotide chain by the enzyme TAC polymerase using the nucleotides provided in the medium. So you can see in the figure in the third step extension step. So after adding these primers so you can see uh, the forward and the reverse primers. So they just synthesize uh, this in this direction. Okay, so here polymerization of nucleotide chain by the enzyme TAC polymerase using the nucleotides provided in the medium. So these are the steps that are involved in the PCR.